Son of Top, go back with another video. I'm Strange Wing, he's Nate. Today we are reacting to Disney's Jungle Cruise. And I look like I just got off a of Jungle Cruise. I look fantastic today. You look like you got Jungle Fever. I got that too. So what are you doing out here? There is a legend in the jungles of the Amazon of a tree that heals all. It could change the world, but if it gets into the wrong hands, it could awaken a great evil. I believe that the legend is real, Which is not. and I'm going to find it. Which you want. And when I do, just imagine the lives that could be saved. I've been looking for this tree longer than anybody. I've tracked the legend to every village, every island. Nothing. You're searching for something that can't be found. But you've never had the key. Let's do something that's safe. Let's go see some elephants. There are no elephants in the Amazon, and I don't even like elephants. Lady, everybody likes elephants. Tell this about the jungle. Everything that you see wants to kill you and can. Careful. They can smell fear. Yeah, that little fast and furious scene in there. Yeah. I think he was wrong about that. Mm. But I think we were right last time when we said their chemistry is unrivaled. Yeah. Both of them separately. Even if the movie's bad, they're great in it. Yeah. Put them together. Even though this movie sucks, it's going to be great just because they're in it. I don't think it's going to suck. Mm -hmm. The only thing I'm a little disappointed about is the Pirate of the Caribbean's ending yeah. was thrown in here. I don't care about people coming out of the ground looking like hogwash and whatnot. Yeah. To me, that's nothing but... Nonsense. My thing is... uh I don't think either of us are huge fans of a lot of CGI, but I expect it in this film. You know, yeah, it's, a, it's a lot of action is going to happen. Yeah. So if, you know, I'm not mad about the fact that there is the CGI stuff in there. I just wish that they wouldn't have uh, directly ripped off one of their own properties. Yeah. Uh, Especially so one that they're apparently rebooting. By having an, an undead pirate in the film. It's whack. But it's okay. I mean, you know, I, I still have a lot of hope for this movie. The humor is still sticking really, really hard for me like it did with yeah. the first trailer. I'm also still stoked about Emily Blunt and The Rock. I'm really interested to see Jesse Plemons as a bad guy because that that's a little hard to wrap my head around, honestly, but I'm open to it. I hate that guy. Why? He shows up in everything. He looks... I don't, I don't have a problem. <laughs> he just looks so stupid. That's Jimmy Hoffa's son. I don't give a fuck who he is. He looks stupid. He has a dumb face. That's Matt Saracen's best friend. I don't even know who that is. But like he's probably dumb too if he's hanging out with him. I just don't like the guy. He shows up in everything. He's like the bad John Barathol. He's like, I want to show up 30 seconds in this movie. I want to show up 30 seconds in this movie. 45 in this movie. He kills a kid in Breaking Bad. Be better example. He's he's the older, less talented Lucas Hedges. <laughs> he's in everything. That's a blockbuster-esque. But he's not good. He's the worst part of Game Night. But nonetheless... I'm still looking forward to this movie. Tell me if you're looking forward to this movie down in the comment section below. I know me and him will be in the theater July 24th to see this week. cinematic experience. I'm French. Will you? Like, share, and subscribe.